It matters where you buy bundles. Hacksify. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of State of Survival at Wacker Rush Gaming. If you have been following my recent videos over the last two months, you know how much I need your help to make your voices heard over the monthly releases of big new money grabbing features in State of Survival. After a cup of coffee, some conversations with my fellow survivors, and upon some reflection, I felt today's video needs to be one to help my fellow mammals. So. This video is the full guide on the latest feature drop today onto states 1 to 900 about the new research feature rally enhancement. If you find my videos helpful, I would really appreciate if you could tap that subscribe button, like the video as it would greatly support my channel. The only prerequisite for now on this new edition is a level 30 research lab. There will be a new material called Tragic Capsules introduced into the game. However, I want everyone to take a deep breath and listen up. The Rally Enhancement research purely focuses on improving your battle stats and your rally capacity. This. This feature is predominantly only for rally leaders. If you're a rally joiner, then you should totally just forget about spending any single dollar on this feature right now. As a rally joiner, I would purely focus on the gorilla and the limitless heroes. You will truly support your rally leader in a rally following my advice. If your state do not have the gorilla and the limitless heroes, then focusing on your plasma research is better than this. I expect most rally joiners to have not maxed their plasma research institute as of right now. And the amount of plasma that's available right now is pretty cheap. Over time, you will get the materials to upgrade them. So, rally joiners, keep calm and have a banana. However, rally leaders, it's up to you how much you want to spend on this. But you know this already, there's always going to be a bigger whale out there. I will just be myself and do what I do. There are going to be four ways to obtain the treasure capsules. You can convert 150 hero gear parts and 12 hero gear designs to obtain 8 treasure capsules. Therefore, in one week with only 20 chances, you can get 160 treasure capsules. Want to know a trick? Well. The conversion will give you points in the Journey of Glory event, so I expect the same for the SVSO SOFT event. Separately, you can get another 100 treasure capsules per week by converting 16,000 hero gear parts or 1,000 hero gear designs. Secondly, in conjunction with the release of this feature, you can make up to 5 infected fiance rallies per day to get another 50 treasure capsule. This collecting over 250 treasure capsules per week. Therefore, as a free to play player, you will be able to to obtain 510 treasure capsules per week. I suspect similar to the other new releases, State of Survival will ultimately add these treasure capsules to other events. But only if you folks make some noise because this is a feature that will cost roughly $3,000 or more to max. With this, the hero gear parts and hero gear designs are now relevant. There are still many ways to obtain this for free through the trap, the Alliance Showdown Goods Swap Store, the World Event Store for me currently being Project Dominion, Facilities Rewards and many more I'm sure. Think and please play smart. With that being said, there will be bundles. There will always be bundles so it should not be a surprise for any of you. However, before you get to enjoy the rest of the show, I wanted to take one minute of your time. Whilst I would love some support from State of Survival, I do not get that since the support from State of Survival comes with various restrictions, including not being able to criticize them like I've done in my previous video. Therefore, today's video is sponsored by Paxify. Many of you who are still spending in State of Survival, have you thought about getting your bundles cheaper? Did you know Paxify can buy the diamonds in-game and you can use it whenever you need it? Paxify offers State of Survival players 10% to 25% in-game. Many State of Survival players are already using them and have given amazing feedback. Thanks to their amazing service, many survivors are already saving a lot of monies. Make sure to check out the link in the description below and make your monies go further than ever before. Now, back to where we left off. I stopped working on the PTR numbers because State of Survival have been using a pattern. The value and quantity needed in the PTR server 
has consistently been 10 times higher than the actual values that are released in the live server. You go from an emotionally high of being frustrated to then accepting that there is a significant reduction. Mentally, it's exhausting, so make sure you look after yourself. Nevertheless, there are good bundles and poopy bundles. As always, I would avoid those poopy bundles, and if you want to spend monies, just focus on purchasing the good bundles. For those of you that know me and watched me grow over the years, I'm never the strongest. I'm a progressive player, and that is never going to match the strongest players because before you know it, State of Survival will make the cost of the latest feature cheaper, but also more easily obtainable. Then added the fact that the new features will be stronger than the previous feature. So my advice to all of you is remember to have fun and stop chasing for the elusive mountain peak sitting above the clouds because the, that peak does not exist in State of Survival. That's all folks, thanks for watching. If you like my videos, please do smack that subscribe button, leave a comment and turn on your notification bell for more amazing videos. Thank you, goodbye.